I just took the these little metal strips out of these older pieces of, of rubber because I have new I have all new rubber for that. So I mean, these are the I'll need to hold on to these because otherwise, other, or, or, or you can order new ones. I think a whole set, including all the screws, is like 20 bucks. So it's not that bad, but I'm gonna use what I can. So I need to give Chucks a call because I was going through this and um, I do not have the. The long webbing strap. I do not have that. It did not come with any of the packing packages that, that I got. And I also says that I was supposed to have some short rods. I don't have those either, but I can make some. Chuck, this is Jerry. Um, I am a, 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 a customer of yours. I just I got the um, deluxe convertible top um, package for 1974 Super Beetle convertible. And I have a, a couple of questions about this. Um, in your in your inspection manual, um, you talk about long webbing straps and also short rods. Were those supposed to come in a, in by the, from the manufacturer? Or was that something you guys were going to be sending? Because um, I never got those. They're not in any of the packing packaging. It's not with the top. It's not with the headliner. It's not with the um, the, the the cushion insulation, and it's not with the second package you guys sent me from. Uh, they had the the rubber seal or that kind of stuff. It, it's not in there, and um, I'm just curious. Um, about that, because <laughs> uh, I'm, 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 I'm in the middle of trying to set things up, and I should have, I should take these all out, all apart in an inventory, but um, I didn't know that I was missing those. I thought they would be part of the, the stuff that was included. So, um, my name is Jerry, and yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm kind of getting started on this, and I don't think I have everything I need. So, thank you very much. Bye. Up over there. So I will I will be cutting these flush with the the nylon nuts, and I'll put tape over it so that whatever is here doesn't snag on anything. But I have these countersunk. This one actually went too far in, but so I'm gonna go on the other side. I'm going to be using the contact cement. I'm not going to be using the 3M. Well, okay, I'm going to use the contact cement on this part of it. Uh, maybe when I do the listings, I'll do the other stuff, but...
hope that is enough. I don't know. I really wish that I had done this before. So I know I didn't do this exactly right. I messed up on this thing. I'm hoping that I can put enough glue that it'll still hold it. I never plan on selling this vehicle. Um, I think when they take my license away, I'm still gonna come out and open up the top and pretend like I'm driving. Um, so I don't, not, it's not that I, I'm still gonna try for the highest, you know, um, job I can do, the best job I can do on this, but Again, I, this, the, from the way this has been starting and all the prep stuff, I don't think this is ever going to be a professional job. I'm still missing some parts, and, and Chuck hasn't called me back. I'm missing this, the, the long straps. I'm missing um, some small rods that he says that are supposed to be there, uh, at least in the instructions. Unless the manufacturer of the top has changed the design, um, if that's the case, then the book is out of date. But it's only been three years or four years since he did the, the, the book. so. I don't know what to say. It's not going to be a professional looking job. It just isn't. But I hope at least it won't sag too bad. Even if it does um, sag a teeny weeny little bit. Um, my other headliner um, was, they had the listing so low that it touched my head every even when, I, when it's on it. So this lease is going to be higher. These listings are a lot uh, less material, so you have to get a lot tighter up onto the onto the, the, the bows. So at least that there's going to be that. Got a heat gun because it's not optimal temperatures in here. See, I really screwed up here. This is where I needed to have those crossovers and I cut it the wrong way. So I don't do it like this. Do not do it like this. If this turns out to be at all a semblance of, of a decently installed top, I will be jumping for joy. Whereas right now, <laughs> I don't see how that's going to happen. Okay, so this is going to be a problem. <laughs> I, uh, I I haven't glued anything down, of course, but um, and I really can't because I mean, see how tight that is. Well, I mean, I know I'm in a, in a colder and cl colder thing, but this isn't able, even closing or close to being closing. I could stretch it more, but that's not that's not really the issue. Is also. I wonder if I just took too much up front. Probably. Yeah, I think I took way too much. We're gonna have to, there's also glue on the upper part, but we'll, we'll get to that in a second, but. Okay, so we're correcting a mistake that I made and Claire had nothing to do with. And that was that I put a little too much material toward this way. And you glued but, it. But I did measure. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's getting stuck back when it falls back down, isn't it? Okay. Okay. my wood top, my wood bow, 
it's all too high because when you stretch it, even, even when you stretch it up to the point where it touches, it still doesn't leave enough room. I mean, even if you got it stretched over it, it pulls that thing open and there's not enough room for this to, to, to reach to it. So I think that this actually probably needs to be, I'm thinking if I brought it down so that, that instead of one and a half, it was two and a half. That gives me an inch of extra material or extra space for this material to reach it and I just don't think it's going to otherwise I know this is this is a cool environment this is a cool thing and this, this stuff will stretch but I used a heating gun on it and it did get warm and then I was able to stretch it a little bit more but not enough not enough for this to be able to still reach it it was like right here where you can't you know so it needs to be, if, it, if this was the case, it would have to be right here. You have that. But if it's right here, I definitely can't, that, that listing will not reach this over here in this angle. So it's really weird. So this is too high. This is definitely too high.